Hello everybody, it is Mr. Modern Financials here coming at you with another video. In this video, I am going to go over which is better for making money online in 2020 and beyond, and that is between drop shipping and affiliate marketing. Now, for those of you who don't know, I have had experience with both affiliate marketing and drop shipping for quite a few years now. I got started making money online in 2017, and I tried a variety variety of different online businesses, all of which did make money, but some, of course, made a lot more than others. I've tried drop shipping. I've tried affiliate marketing. I have tried e-commerce. I have tried paid surveys, okay? I have tried Instagram marketing. I have tried so many different things out there that I think I have a lot of authority to speak on, which has made me personally the most money. And I'm going to give some insights to you on why. So as you see right here, this is ClickBank. This is one of the most popular affiliate marketing websites right here. This is AliExpress, one of the most popular drop shipping websites. Before I go on, I'm going to make a quick note on what is drop shipping, what's affiliate marketing. Drop shipping is when you list something on your website or on eBay or on Amazon. You do not buy the product, but you have it set so when someone else buys it on that website or on eBay or on Amazon, you have a software, most people use a software, where it automatically buys it from AliExpress and then ships it to them. Of course, you charge more than what it costs you and you pocket the difference. Affiliate marketing, usually done with digital products, but not always. Always, and this is simply just selling someone else's product, usually digital informational products, okay? So that's the difference between the two. Now, which is better? Well, let me go over a couple things with dropshipping. Dropshipping is great because it has very low upfront uh, cost, but of course, so does affiliate marketing, almost nothing up front. Um, drop shipping is great because you don't have to, you know, have a ton of inventory in your house, okay? But what are the cons of drop shipping? One, the margins are so thin and it's so competitive, okay? So what do I mean by that? Well, for most things, like, like, look at this, um, we'll go to anything on this, okay? Let's go to here. We can look at this little um, security IP camera, right? Little security camera going between $13 and $38, depending on which kind you get. Now, this if someone buys this for $13, right, they're also going to have to most likely pay shipping unless there's free shipping, okay? And they get it for $13, they're going to list it on eBay or Amazon for $25, maybe offer free shipping, and they're probably going to make it like 4 to $5 after shipping and after fee on the product. The problem is anyone could do that. There's no barrier to entry here, okay? And so because of that, all of this is going to get very, very saturated. And the, really the trick of doing e-commerce and really drop shipping in general is to find good products that not a lot of other people are selling. That is really the trick here, and that is very difficult to do because you get this, you list it for 25, someone else sees it listed for 25, they list it for 24, someone else sees it for 24, they list it for 23, and eventually your final person in the chain of, of, of selling is only making one or two dollars per, per, per item, okay? So with that being said, that's a big problem with drop shipping. Another big, so number one, the big problem is the margins. The margins are not that good, okay, usually. Um, there are, again, this is just generalization. There are great drop shippers out there. The other problem with drop shipping is uncertainty. So most drop shipping is done from China or, you know, Taiwan or wherever into the United States or into Europe or into wherever. A lot of it's done from China, Singapore, Philippines, countries like those. And of course, I'm not making a political statement here at all. I am not political at all. I am just simply saying that if there are issues with tariffs and there is uncertainty, certainty in the world, in the global economy, that could cause your prices, your shipping prices to go way up, okay? So if you're drop shipping from China into America and tariffs go, you know, go up 20%, that's going to eat directly into your profits. Of course, you'd want to raise prices 20%, but then people buy less of it, okay? Because as you raise prices, people buy less. So those are some key issues with drop shipping. 
Now let's go into affiliate marketing. Affiliate marketing is usually selling digital products that other people own, and usually you'll have either a free source of traffic or a paid source of traffic or both. I like to do both, okay? And with this being said, affiliate marketing usually, it doesn't even really have margins because there's no cost to selling the product, okay? The only cost is really the advertising, and that's if you're doing paid traffic. So affiliate marketing is, with especially with digital products, it's going to not really have margins. You know, if, if, if you're selling a $20 product and you're making, you know, uh, you, a lot of the time they'll have like 60, 70% commissions on there. So you're selling a $20 product and you're making 17 bucks on it. You know, that's all profit for you. Okay. That's all profit. And there's a lot of products out here that are like 50 bucks, right? A lot of these informational products are around the 40 to $50 range. And if you could sell a, one of those a day, you're making a decent income. Okay. You're making a decent income doing that. And it doesn't get super competitive because you using ClickBank, you can look at their gravity score. The gravity score will show you how many other people are selling it successfully, and you want to find a gravity score that's not too high and not too low. I will do a video on that in the future, so be sure you hit that subscribe button. Another thing that's great about affiliate marketing, especially with digital products, is you're not affected by uncertainty. Tariffs don't matter. Nothing in the global economy matters when you're doing affiliate marketing because they're digital products. There's nothing to ship, okay? Another great uh, thing about affiliate marketing is that even if you get returns, the returns don't cost you any money. Versus drop shipping, you get a return, you're eating the cost because you have to either ship it back or just tell them to keep it and you refund their money, right? So that's a problem with drop shipping is refunds and returns. But with affiliate marketing, someone does a refund or a return, okay, you didn't make the money, but it didn't cost you any money to do other than maybe the advertising, okay? So that's another great thing about affiliate marketing. Overall, if you're looking to make money in this year and beyond, I would highly suggest going into affiliate marketing over drop shipping. I'm not saying drop shipping is bad. I'm not saying drop shipping doesn't have its place. I've done drop shipping successfully in the past, but affiliate marketing, being someone who has at one time been a beginner and is now an expert, so to speak, I would much rather recommend a beginner in internet, uh, you know, making money online. I would much rather recommend them to go into affiliate marketing just because they're so many better benefits to it versus drop shipping. And again, you could do both eventually, right? You definitely could do both out sometime in the future, but I would highly recommend to start with affiliate marketing. Now, if you're wondering how do I start with affiliate marketing, number one, you subscribe to this YouTube channel. Okay, you subscribe to this YouTube channel because I will have lots of reviews and videos up in the future. Number two, if you're willing to spend a little bit of money up front, I actually have a program linked in the description, okay? Ultimate Affiliate Marketing Program, it will redirect you to the actual product. You click that link, you get the product, you get the first trial, okay? You check it out, you give it a try, and I definitely, definitely, definitely think you're going to have a lot of success with it because a lot of other people did. I have not had a refund yet for that product. A lot of people are loving it, okay? And people are making a lot of money using that program in the description. So if you want to make money online, if you want to start building an affiliate marketing business, you've got to click that link in the description because that will show you everything you need to know on making money online from home, from your computer with no nine to five job. Guys, it's Mr. Modern Financials here. I will catch you in the next video. As always, have a great day. And again, if you want to start making money online, you got to click that link in the description.